Hello, in this video I will set up Maxify GX3000 and connect to the network. This model may have the following names in different countries. And here is what I cover in the video. For a detailed product review, check the video in the upper right corner. In the first part I will set up the printer. I get my printer ready for the setup and the unboxing with dimensions you can find in the previous video. This printer is powered for the first time and I walk through the initial steps. Setting language and then setting date and time. The firmware on this device can be automatically updated and this is a recommended setting. Next, I fill up the printer with ink. In different regions, there may be different starter ink bottle capacities, but inks are the same. All Maxify inks are pigment and water resistant. You can find the water resistant test of the Maxify print at the end of the video. Each bottle has its own mechanical ID, so you cannot miss the wrong ink. The setup color bottle is smaller than standard. I put setup and standard bottle capacity on the screen. After soft closing of the cover, the initial printer alignment process will start. Do not skip or interrupt this part. Let's put some plain paper to the cassette. This model has three paper trays. The third one is the rear flat tray and the video on how to use that one you find in the upper right corner of the screen. Now I leave the printer for 10 minutes until the print head alignment is printed. When setting up the new printer you can already start the Wi-Fi setting by opening the Canon print app during the initial process but I will cover the network connection in the next part.
Wi-Fi setup on this device starts by press and hold of connect button for 3 seconds. And then you should see the printer hotspot. Download and open the Canon Print app and follow the steps in the video. The Wi-Fi setup process will take some minutes. The app has found the printer hotspot. If this does not happen, you can still manually connect to Canon Inkjet Hotspot in the Smart Device Wi-Fi settings. I connect to my network called Home and as my Smart Device already knows the password, I do not need to type it again, but you may need to type it. On the screen you can follow the connection status. And few moments later, the printer is also registered in the Canon Print app. There are a lot of features available in the app. You can access the online manuals or connect to cloud. For printer utilities, administration password needs to be set. See the status of the printer ink levels and maintenance cartridge. Let's do the first print on this device from the mobile app. So, here is the proof that I really print on this device for the first time in this video. Find the video about higher GX models in the upper right corner and for the end of the video I will do the water resistant ink test. As Maxify GX models all have pigment inks, the full color output on plain paper is laser-like quality and water resistant. And that would be all in this video. In the next videos about these models I do the copy video with the speed test then I will install the drivers and software and there will be detailed video about using the flat tray. And if you subscribe and turn on the bell, you will be notified when I upload. Find more about printers on my channel and more about Maxify GX in the playlist. Thank you for watching and sharing. Bye.